basic salary 38,800 over time 10,900 another over time 7,700 cell phone allowance 735 shift allowance 6.5 housing allowance 6,255 total earnings 71,000 Welcome to the village. My name is Bonnie. I create content around careers, education with the doors of reality check. Today we have a short and sweet video on safety officers. This is the highly requested video. Uh, a lot of people have been asking me about safety officers. So I have about four pay slips of safety officers. They just have a uh, different levels of experience and also an inline analyst. Um, I thought, okay, let me just hold this pay slip here. Uh, though I, I don't know if I should consider them a safety officer, but you know what? I asked him, what does an inline analyst do? We do, we do analysis of vitamins and mir minerals. I didn't do anything course wise. I did in house training. I was appointed when I was appointed. However, I do have a same track one and two from NOSA College. I'm on a second year studying diploma in health and safety management with Stadio. Okay. Now, let's see how much O inline analyst is earning. Okay. Basic salary 20,720, overtime 1.5. There's shift allowance, there's overtime, overtime, overtime. Total earnings 33,454 and in a pay of 21,844. That's a pay slip of a inline analyst. Now let's see what this uh, safety officer has in store for us. Hi, buddy. I'm a safety officer with same track and small certificates. I completed my courses last year and I want to further my OHS studies okay basic salary 26,100 and uh, then there's some hours 10,000 and then overtime 14,000 shift allowance 1.1 total earnings 52,000 rents total deductions uh, 12,191 and then a pay of 39,890 all righty now let's move quickly to safety officer number two. They studied through NOSA as well. Basic salary 53,968. Shift allowance 11,253. Performance allowance 11,000 rands. Incentive 18,730. Okay. All I can say here is rate per hour is 337 and the it says here a department civil engineering okay guys most people don't want to give maybe they don't want to share industry you know while i know in safety officers the industry is very important you know i've been hearing that people who work in the mines they definitely get paid a lot compared to people who work maybe in construction all right Total earnings for this month was 95,000 rents. Total deductions, 21,532. And then a pay of 65,221. That's a pay slip of a safety officer. Now, let's move to the third one. Hi, Bonnie. Uh, I have some track. Guys, you know what is some track. I'm currently busy with a safety management diploma via UNISA. I work in a company uh, as a contractor for a mine. Okay, so this one did say, Uti, they work for a mine as a contractor uh, in a mine. They have a three years experience. Okay, so let's see how much they are earning. Basic salary, 38,800 over time, 10,900. Another overtime, 7,700. Cell phone allowance, 735. Shift allowance, 6.5. Housing allowance, 6,255. 
total earnings of 71,000 and in a pay of 50,751. He's got his provident fund, pay a pay as you earn. Um, yeah, so total deduction 20,000 and in a pay of 50,751. I don't know how the village feels about this one. <laughs> how does the village feel? How does the village feel? Guys, if you have any questions regarding these pay slips, uh, be sure to drop them in the comment section and I will go back to the people and ask them to come to the video or I will just respond on their behalf, okay? Maybe they won't want to come to the video because now we're going to know who they are. But what I normally do when it's pay slips, I go back and ask them questions and then I go back and give them your questions and then they will give me the answer okay so i know some things might be confusing here okay the last one is a facilities officer but i i put them in here because i just feel like it's it's it's, it's a similar job you know they have a advanced diploma in construction and health and safety so i just want to give you ideas of what you can do with your health and safety okay um yeah so they only spend two months without a job after completing their diploma they work in a in a public college as a facilities officer okay let's see how much they are earning basic salary 29,990 and then they pay tax and other things um deductions is 9,600 and then a pay of 20,321. Okay, guys, I had no intentions of editing this year, but I just remembered that someone asked me about food technology and I can't make an entire video on food technology, you know. So I just thought, okay, let me add this pay slip of someone who's in the food technology space, okay? This person works as a food technologist, they, they have a diploma in the, uh, food technology okay um they are a manager with five years of experience okay so let's see how much they are earning basic salary is 28,500 rands commission 17,200 yo okay uh cross earnings 45,700 rands and then they have comfortable provident fund a uh, medical aid um yeah guys this is a good deal here yeah? Total deductions 14,680 and then a pay of 31,000 rands. I'm surprised, guys. Um, <laughs> this is really a, a good uh, deal. The commission, they say they work in R&D space. Uh, so I'm sure people who are in the space, uh, they would know, uh, is it R&D? Yeah, yes, R&D space. Uh, so yeah, I'm sure people would know uh, what R&D is, all right? otherwise guys uh thanks for supporting um this village uh, i see you share the content you comment you like i really appreciate that i'm still thinking what are we going to to post in december what are we doing in december you know but um yeah you can share some ideas some thoughts with me otherwise i'll see you on the next one Bye bye